Alright, so Alright, so first like you're most likely gonna have it on your download. So first you wanna just check on your like so when I was saying about the echo example, I was talking about this. So if you list bin echo is right here. So every time you try to execute echo, it knows exactly like what what binary file to execute because like you you follow this path and it follows the root and then it goes to bin and then it checks like if there's any binary file called echo and then it executes that. Um, so if you're having like uh, some kind of problem with your GCC, uh, like your ARM GCC compiler, then like it's most likely the stuff you download is going to be in your um, in the user. Where is it at? Yeah. So you want to change into the user. Sorry about the phone. Um, and then most uh, you could check that binary file right here, but it's most likely not going to be in there. Uh, you could look inside the local. Um, and then now, like here for me, it's right here, GCC arm. If it's not here, then um, then that that's your problem. Um, for me, like if I go into GCC arm, it's right there. And then I could just ls the bin, and then everything's right here. Uh, GCC is right here. And then yeah, so if you don't have that, then that's your problem. Luckily, hopefully that's what it is. Like that's the only thing. And then after you do that, after you like, let's say like you, you you move the folder here. This is I think I think I I moved my downloaded file here, uh, but I'll make sure. And then what I did was, after I did that, um, I went into my home directory and then into my my uh, profile, and then in here, I just export the path. So I'll explain what that is. So right here, this is this. This is what I did right here. So that way, like, like I was saying, like, um, how do you know, like, whether, like, echo, like, how do you know that, like, like you can execute echo, right? How is that a command? So, like, you know how I said, like, you could go to the binary file and then execute the binary file. Well, like in this case, like, there's like a certain path that your computer goes through to like execute the binary binary file to like look for that file. But in this case, like, since it's like in a, somewhere unique, like in the local, uh, it's in the user local, and then like in, inside like some kind of specific directory. I have to like append a new path. So like, like for example, um, if I execute some command, so like the GCC command, it's only gonna look through the root bin, and then it's and if it doesn't find it there, then it's just gonna be like, okay, I have no binary called um, GCC arm, so I'm assume that you don't have it. So what I do here is like I append a path. So like if you don't find it previously, then I know for sure that the binary file is located in here in the user local GCC arm. GCC arm none ob and then bin and then that's basically it so hopefully that helps hopefully that's it uh, good luck